guys, it's Candace back with another video. And for today's video, we do have another requested video. In case you didn't know, it's my requested video list. Today's video is another requested video, and today's requested video is gonna be about my first song. Throws page, drops mic, whatever. So here's a little diddly. Diddly? I don't know. But here's a little story about my first song. This was probably when I was around 16, probably like 15 or 16 years old. I had seen everyone in my school wearing thong underwear and wearing G-strings and being all extra cute and extra sexy and even though I wasn't supposed to be trying to be cute or sexy at that age, looking back now I realize, but at that time, you know, you see all of your friends, they're all super popular and you think it's because they have the one thing that you do not have, sexy underwear. <laughs> So that was my thought process at the time. I come from pretty strict Puerto Rican parents, more strict than a lot of my friends that I saw growing up. My dad and then my mom, she was always like very open to talk to us about anything and she would tell us all the time like, oh you guys can come to me, you can talk to me about anything. So we always knew that we could talk to my mom about stuff, but at the same time you you know you're a teenager at that time and you're like oh my mom's not gonna understand if I try to ask her about this or oh my mom is gonna tell my dad that was always my thing I was always super comfortable with my mom like if I wanted to go and talk to her about anything I knew that I could but I knew that she was gonna tell my dad I didn't want to ask my parents to take me to the store to buy me thong underwear because I knew my dad was gonna flip a uh, shit and that's actually an understatement did what any 15 or 16 year old girl would do. <laughs> Went through my mom's drawer. My mom is a very organized woman, very like clean, cleanly, like just like the perfect like mom. Like what you think about when you think of a mom, that's my mom. So my mom had this beautiful underwear drawer. She had like bras to match all the panties and everything was like lined up all fancy and the panties are folded real cute and the bras are laid out real cute. Stupid me. Go into my mom's underwear drawer and I steal a thong from her. I wanted to be sexy. I don't know why because I was chubby and I was, just, I was 16. Why am I trying to be sexy? But, not only did I get a thong, I didn't just get a thong. No, 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 no. I grabbed one of my mom's G-strings. And I'm talking about this sexy G-string that like, you have to tie up on the sides. Yeah, one of those. So stupid. So I took that out of my mom's underwear drawer and I wore it to school the next day. And I felt very, very sexy. I'm pretty sure I, you know, I've always been kind of like an attention seeker. I'm pretty sure I let them hang out of my pants when I sat down, you know, so I felt very, very sexy, needless to say. That night, I went in my mom's drawer again and I took another pair. And I did the same thing the next night. I took another pair. My mom had so many with tags on them still, and those are the ones that I was taking, is the ones that were brand new with tags that she didn't even notice or I thought she wasn't gonna notice. Remember before, I told you guys, my mom had matching sets. Since she had a matching set, imagine my mom, when she goes into her drawer to look for her lilac bra and the missing thong is nowhere to be found. She goes the next day, goes to wear the pink bra. The pink drawstring is nowhere to be found. She thinks for like a second, because she knew it was me. She came up to me, I remember I was in my room and my mom came up to me and she was like, hey, she's like, have you been stealing my underwear out of my underwear drawer? And I was like, I'm gonna call it stealing, I would call it borrowing, because I'm gonna wash them and put them back. And my mom was like, no, that's gross, let's go to the store. This whole time, I'm sitting here thinking my mom is gonna flip a shit and tell my dad and really all she did was say like, oh, please don't wear my undies because that's kind of nasty. And in retrospect, I agree. So thank you mom for taking me to the store to buy my own undies. There was an exception, however, where I couldn't get like G-string or overtly sexy underwear. Like I just had to stick to like the plain color cotton undies. 
not even stuff that like said stuff on them or anything like that because my mom told my dad of course that she was gonna take me to the store to buy me underwear and I'm pretty sure my dad freaked out because I was his little girl I was his I'm the first girl my I have an older brother but I'm the first girl so I'm sure it was hard for him to deal with mentally but he did let me buy them and I've been buying them ever since because I hate panty lines with a freaking passion for all those of you who have asked that is the tale of my first song thank you guys so much for watching and as always I'll see you on the next video